A question I'm often asked is what to charge for consulting fees. Now, I know a lot of you are in real estate and I'm big on consulting. I'm big on generating multiple streams of cash flow. And um, I don't believe in free consulting. I think you guys work hard, you study, you go to a lot of seminars, real estate clubs, you buy a lot of books and informational products, and you're doing deals out there. Should you be paid for your time, knowledge, and energy? Answer, absolutely. But how much do you charge? And um, so I want you to put a value on, on these um, natural resources of yours. If you're working on a real estate deal, for instance, I use a, um, a formula of one to 10% of the value of the property. For instance, you're working on a million dollar home. Um, 10% would be 100,000, that seems too high to me. But 1%, $10,000 on that million dollar home. And of course, use your best judgment. You can adjust this. If it's a simple or an easy question, or you're not gonna, you're gonna spend less than an hour, maybe you wanna charge 250 to, um, maybe a thousand dollars, something of that range. If it's something where you're going to spend many hours, you're going to work weeks or months on the project, then you have to adjust. You have to estimate how much time. But as a basic starting point, I would say one to 10%. So if you're working on a hundred thousand dollar condo, maybe you'll start with the 10%. That would be a thousand, that would be um, $10,000 or one percent, or maybe 5% would be $5,000. Um, it just depends on how much time you put in. So you take a one to 10% ratio on the value of the property and you adjust it depending on the size. Then you also place uh, how many hours you're gonna put into it, how complicated it is. Are you gonna have expenses? Um, are you gonna have to do traveling? Are you gonna have to hire other people and to uh, answer the questions and uh, fin complete the project? So I'm sorry to be over broad on this thing, but I usually just start with that range of one to 10% and the time involved, and it seems to work very well. There seems to be a certain repetition. If you're working on a deal with somebody to help them with marketing or um, what, contract, uh, what contract you would recommend your personal opinion or connections to other people, and you adjust um, your prices accordingly. Um, consulting is just a great area to get into. Uh, no matter what field you're in, I know like I said, a lot of you are in real estate right now. So when you're speaking to somebody and you don't want to touch the deal, it's too far away. Logistically, it's not practical um, or it's the kind of deal too much repair, too much investment, but people want to pick your brain. Um, today, use the technology, use Zoom, use Skype, use FaceTime. Um, tell them this is, or ask a few questions to get an idea if this is a project you can work on. Do you have the background or expertise to help somebody, um, you know, for their needs and then go accordingly say, this is what I charge. This is what I'm going to be doing. Do you give guarantees for your consulting business? I don't recommend it. There's too many unknowns in there, but you have to, you know, you have to produce or give your best recommendations. Maybe you have to document them, send recordings, follow up and email. Consulting is a wonderful part of this business. I do recommend that, uh, I recommend to all my students to get into it. I just think it's a great way to create uh, uh, alternative incomes and get paid for your time, knowledge and energy. And this is Claude Diamond. And if you, um, I do give free consultations, by the way, on my webpage, claudediamond.com. There's a little calendar there. It says introductory. Just have to click on it and I won't charge you. Uh, you can ask me any questions that's uh, within reason for 15 minutes. And maybe you won't even have to pay me anything. Maybe we can just solve it very quickly. Um, I do answer my own phone, 970-281-5151. Hope this helps you. Take care.